Coverdale Bible The Prophet Isai What Isai Containeth Chapter 6 The Sending of Isai The Hard Hearts of the People The Sixth Chapter In the same year the king that King Ozias died, I saw the Lord sitting upon an high and glorious seat, and his train filled the palace. From above flakered the seraphims, whereof every one had six wings. With twain each covered his face, with twain his feet and with twain did he fly. They cried also each one to other on this manner, Holy, holy, holy is the Lord of hosts. The whole world is full of his glory. Yeah, the geests and door cheeks moved at their crying, and the house was full of smoke. Then I said, O woe is me, for I was astonished, that I, which am a man of unclean lips, and dwell among people that hath unclean lips also, should see the King and Lord of hosts with mine eyes. Then flew one of the seraphims unto me, having a hot coal in his hand, which he had taken from the altar with the tongs, and touched my mouth, and said, Lo, this hath touched thy mouth, and thy unrighteousness is taken away, and thy sin forgiven. After this I heard the voice of the Lord taking advisement on this manner. Whom shall I send, and who will be our messenger? Then I said, Here am I, send me. And so he said, Go and tell this people, Ye shall hear indeed, but ye shall not understand. Ye shall plainly see, and not perceive. Harden the heart of this people, stop their ears, and shut their eyes, that they see not with their eyes, hear not with their ears, and understand not with their hearts, and convert and be healed. Then spake I, Lord, how long? He answered, Until the cities be utterly without inhabitants, and the houses without men, till the land be also desolate, and lie unbuilded. For the Lord shall take the men far away, so that the land shall lie waste. Nevertheless, the tenth part shall remain therein, for it shall convert and be fruitful. And likewise, as the the terebinths and oak trees bring forth their fruits, so shall the holy seed have fruits.